Mastering Irregular Verbs Fill in the Blanks Challenge Hello, language learners. Today we're diving deep into the world of irregular verbs. Specifically, we're going to practice filling in the blanks with correct irregular verb forms. This is a key skill when it comes to mastering English grammar, and we're going to make it fun. Before we jump into our practice exercise, let's quickly review. Irregular verbs are verbs that do not follow the regular conjugation patterns of past simple and past participle forms. Unlike regular verbs, which typically end in ed in the past tense, irregular verbs have unique forms. For example, go becomes went in the past tense and write becomes wrote. The best way to get comfortable with these is simply through practice and memorization. To get started, let's review some common irregular verbs. Begin, began, begun. Eat, ate, eaten. Swim, swam, swum. See, saw, seen. Take, took, taken. Don't worry if you're feeling a bit overwhelmed. With practice, these will become second nature. Now it's time for some practice. Here are some sentences where we'll need to fill in the blanks with the correct form of the irregular verb provided. 1. She, blank, begin, to work on the project yesterday. 2. I have, blank, eat, sushi before. 3. They, blank, swim, in the lake last summer. 4. We have, blank, see, that movie twice. 5. She, blank, take, my book by mistake last week. Don't rush, take your time and remember the forms we reviewed in the previous section. Ready to check your work? Let's go over the answers. 1. She began, begin, to work on the project yesterday. 2. I have eaten, eat, sushi before. 3. They swam, swim, in the lake last summer. 4. We have seen, see, that movie twice. 5. She took, take, my book by mistake last week. If you made some mistakes, that's okay. Remember, the key is consistent practice. Well done, everyone. You're well on your way to mastering English irregular verbs. Remember, practice makes perfect, and every little bit of effort counts. Keep working on these exercises, and soon you'll be using irregular verbs like a pro. Until next time, keep practicing and happy learning.